In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use the count unique ifs function here in Google Sheets. So the count unique ifs function counts the unique values within a specified range, which is also filtered according to criteria applied to other ranges. So in my example data set right here, what I'm trying to do is to count how many unique items are being kept in the San Francisco warehouse. So we're going to try and do that with the count unique ifs function. So let's start our formula with the equal sign. Type in count and select count unique ifs from your selection. There we have it. And here is our formula. So the first part of our formula would be our range where we're going to be counting the unique items. So that's in this range right here, comma. Then our criteria range, where our criteria will be coming from. So that's the second column right here, comma. And for our criterion, that's going to be the San Francisco warehouse. So you can select this cell right here, or you can select it from here, or you can just type it in, in quotations. That's totally up to you. And if I press enter, there we have it. It's telling us that there are four unique items that are being kept in the San Francisco warehouse. Now, how do we check this? Well, one way we can do it would be to apply a filter right here on our data set. So let's right click on this and create a filter. Click on the filter icon and deselect everything and just select San Francisco. If we click on OK, there we have it. Now we can see all the items that are being kept in our San Francisco warehouse. And you'll see right away that there are two measuring spoons, two spatulas, but just one mixing bowl and one piping bag. So we have our first unique item, our second unique item, our third unique item, and our fourth unique item. And there you have it. So our count unique ifs function helps us break down the unique items without doing all of this manually. So that's just one simple example on how we can use the count unique ifs function here in Google Sheets. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, do leave a like and subscribe for more helpful videos. See you on the next one.